Good morning, guys. Beautiful morning here. Uh, we got a little snow on the ground. It's a little bit chilly today. We've had a few warm days, um, and now it's down a little chillier. And I thought it would be a good day to get the crock pot out, get some stew beef that I just bought, and throw it in there with a bunch of other stuff, and see how it tastes. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to put in some cream of mushroom soup. I've already got my potatoes, onions, um, and garlic chopped up in there. Spread them out a little. And then my stew beef, that what I just put in was the cream of chicken. And stew beef is going in, I got two packages. And there, there we go. Now you can brown that in your pan first. I'm not gonna bother. This thing's gonna cook for probably seven or eight hours, so I'm not gonna bother to do that. It's basically just for the looks. But when it gets done, it'll be brown anyway. So I'm gonna do a little salt and pepper on the beef. And then on top of that, I'm gonna do a little bit of ranch dressing. It's the uh, powdered mix. And I'm just sprinkling that over. All right, I'll put the lid on. So I put it on uh, eight hours. I don't think it's gonna have to cook that long. I'm gonna keep an eye on it. Um, I put it on high for the first hour. I'm gonna let it cook, give it a stir, um, and then turn it down to low and cook until probably there's, mm, I don't know, an hour left. And then I have some already cooked carrots that I'm gonna put in here. So they don't need to be cooked. I just wanna get them warmed up in with everything else. Um, so probably about an hour before um, before it's done, I'll check it and put those in, and we'll come back a little later and see how it tastes. Okay, guys, so this is all done. It's been cooking all day long. I waited till the last hour. I added my um, carrots that were already cooked. Uh, after I put everything in earlier, I decided I wanted a little bit more soupier. So I took the two cans, the chicken, the cream of chicken can and the cream of mushroom can, and I put about half a, half a can of water in it and swished it around to try and get all that stuff out of there. And I poured it in. So it's basically one can of uh, just water um, that I put in there just to make it a little bit more, so it wasn't so thick, just to make it a little more, um, just to make it thinner, I guess is what I wanna say. So I made some biscuits, just my regular Bisquick biscuits, just like on the package. I add a touch more water to them so that they're not so dry. And I also add um, chopped up garlic and a little garlic powder to make it even garlicer. Garlicer. Is that even a word? Garlicer? I, I don't know. More garlicky. How's that? <laughs> um, so I like to add, we like garlic around here, so I like to add a lot of garlic to it. But let me show you what it looks like in the pot, and then we will um, put it in the dish on the plate and see what it tastes like. All right. So there it is. It's got the potatoes, and it's got the big uh, um, carrots in it. 
and all that. All right, so let me turn you this way. Sorry about all the turning. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut my biscuit in half and flop the top right over. Take that right out of there. And then I'm going to scoop up some of this yummy goodness, put it over the top. Gravy and all. Yummy. Get a couple more pieces of beef in there. Give me some beef. As you can see, it's still pretty hot. The the um, the beef mixture has been sitting for about an hour with no heat or anything. It's just been sitting, but the biscuit is probably warm because it just came out. So um, there's that, and I'll bring you back up and I'll give it a taste and see if I like it. All right, guys. So here it is. It's all done. I'm gonna take a quick little little bite. Mmm, that's good with that garlicky biscuit and that gravy and everything on there. Oh boy, that's good. Yeah, Scott's gonna love it. Um, this is quick and easy as far as making it, as far as cooking it. Of course, it takes all day in the crock pot, but you could use your Dutch oven in the oven and cook it a lot quicker or on the stove. There's just something about cooking it in the crock pot and having it come out quick and um, you know, already done for you. So anyway, take care guys, like, share, subscribe, and hope you like this dinner.